Hello friends, today we are going to solve CBSC class 10th maths exercise 5.2 question number 3. In the following APs, find the missing terms in the boxes. Look here. In, this is an AP, they had given first term and they had given third term and we have to find out the second term. So, first term is given to you, so directly you can write down A is 2. Now, third term is given to you, means A3 is equal to 26. So, we are going to use this third term. We know that A3 is equal to A plus 2D. Now, put up the value. It is 26. A is 2 and 2D. So, take this 2 on that side. 26 minus 2 is equal to 2D. So, 24 is equal to 2D. So, 24 by 2 is equal to D. So, you can say 12. Your difference will be 12. Now you got 12. You don't want difference. You want second term. A2. A2 is equal to A plus D. So now your A is 2. And your difference is 12. So put up there. And your A2 will be 14. So your second term will be 14. So this way you can find out this. Now look here. For question number 2, they had not given you first term, not given you third term, they had only given you second and third term. So, you are having A2 that is 13 and A4 that is 3. So, what you have to do? Again, you know that A2 is equal to A plus D. So, instead of A2, we are having 13 is equal to A plus D. Take it as equation number 1. Now, from A4. Again, you will get A4 is equal to A plus 3D. So, again, you are having A4, 3. So, keep it here. A3 is equal to A plus 3D. This is your equation number 2. Look at this. Both are linear equation with two variables. We can solve this by elimination, substitution, cross multiplication, whatever. I am going to solve by elimination. 13 is equal to A plus D. 3 is equal to A plus 3D. Sign change by subtracting, I will get the answer. This A will get cancelled. Here you will get minus 2D and you will here you will get D. So it will be 2D is equal to minus 10. I change and D will be minus 10 by 2. So D is equal to minus 5. Now you got minus 5 as D. They had not given you first term and third term. So and you don't want D. Now putting this value in any of the equations you will get A. Look here, I am putting it here. A plus D is equal to 13. So, A plus minus 5 is equal to 13. Take that on that. A is equal to 13 plus 5. A is equal to 18. So, your first number is 18. And they told you to find third term. That is A plus 2D. Now, you put up the values. I am doing it. A, A3 is equal to A plus 2D. That is, A is 18 plus 2 multiply with minus 5. So, 18 minus 10, it is sorry, minus 5, 18 minus 10, that is 8. So, this number will be 8. So, this way you can solve this. Look here, in third one, again they had given you few things. A, that is 5. Now, A4, this is first term, second term, third term, fourth term. A4 that is 9 integer 1 by 2. You can write down 9 to the 18 plus 1. 19 by 2. Again from this A4 you will get a equation. A4 is equal to A plus 3D. So put up the value. 5 you are having A. You are having 3. You are having difference. Sorry. You don't have difference. So you keep it B as that same same. Only. And you are having A4 that is 19 by 2. Now take this. Here 19 by 2 minus y is equal to 3d. Again you have to take out LCM into 2 into 2. 19 minus 10 by 2. That is 3d. So 9 by 2 into 3 in the denominator is equal to d1, 3. So your difference will be 3 by 2. Now you got difference. Now you can find out a2 and a3 both. A2 is equal to A plus D, that is A5 uh, plus 3 by 2. Again, you have to find out LCM 
this will be 10 plus 3 by 2 13 by 2 so this will be 13 by 2 and again this a 3 that is a plus 2d that is 5 plus 2 multiplied by 3 by 2 so 2 to get cancel 5 plus 3 that is 8 so this will be 8 now moving toward question number 4 look here again they had given you first term and they had given you 1 2 3 4 5 6 term a is minus 4 a6 is 6 so again a6 is equal to a plus 5d put up the values 6 minus 4 plus 5d take this minus 4 on that side 6 plus 4 is equal to 5d 10 by 5 is equal to d it's 2 d is equal to 2 now you got d you can find all the numbers one by one that is a2 is equal to a plus d that is minus 4 plus 2 minus 2 this will be minus 2 a3 that is a plus 2d that is minus 4 plus 2 into 2 minus 4 plus 4 0 directly without solving also I can give you the answer this will be 2 and this will be 4 but you have to put and find out this and tell them answer question number 5 look here they had given us this second term and sixth term 1 is not given a1 is not given a3 is not there a4 is not there a5 is not there so they had given you 2 term a2 that is 38 and a6 that is minus 22 so from these two terms you will get two equation look here i am doing it here so that you can see a2 is equal to a plus d means 38 is equal to a plus d equation number one now a6 is equal to a plus 5d that is minus 22 is equal to a plus 5d equation number two with the help of these two equation you can solve and find out a and d after that a and d you will put here look here i am going to solve by a, a, a elimination method a plus d minus 22 a plus 5d so sign change sign change sign change this will get cancelled minus 4d and this will be 0 carry 1 6 so mm, you can say 4d is equal to minus 60 d is equal to minus 60 by 4 ones are it's 1 5 so your difference will be minus 50 now putting this in this equation number 2 or 1 wherever you want to put i am going to put in equation number 1 38 is equal to a plus minus 15 so this minus 15 take that on set that side plus 15 that is equal to a so 8 9 10 13 carry 1 4 and 5 a is equal to 53 so we got a and d now a so this will be 53 now you we want to find third term fourth term and fifth term so directly third term a3 is equal to a plus 2d put up the values directly 53 plus 2 multiply with minus 15 that is 53 minus 30 so 3 and 2 minus so this will be positive only 23 now again a4 also you can find out similarly you can find out a4 by a plus 3d a5 by a plus 4d so this way you will get this two answer also Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.